Hey yo, what's good YouTube? It's your boy the Summer 2 and back with another video. And on today's video, I'm going to be showing off five great anime games on Roblox in my opinion. So any anime game that I played on Roblox I ended up really enjoying and really liking while playing it. I'm gonna be showing it off in this video. Just keep in mind boys. I'm not going to be showing off just any anime games on Roblox. I'm going to be showing off the best of the best anime games out there that you're most likely going to enjoy yourself because they got good numbers and a lot of people enjoyed them, not only me. And with that being said, let's get right into the video. Number five. All right, number five is Blocks Fruits. Blocks Fruits is the number one One Piece game on Roblox, whether you like it or not. These are the facts, boys. This game is the most played One Piece game on Roblox. Till this day, I think Bruh. it probably won't be when the new One Piece game comes out, which I'm not going to be talking about in this video. If this video, though, hits a good amount of likes and does really good. I'll definitely make another video similar to this one where I'm going to be showing off and talking about anime games are in the making. Good anime games are in the making. And one of those games are going to be the One Piece game that I'm talking about. And I really think this One Piece game is it, you know, the one that's in the making. If it drops, I really think it's the one that could you know defeat this game and surpass it and do way better because by the looks of it that one piece game is looking hella good most of you guys probably know which game i'm talking about because that game is pretty popular it's already you know known by a lot of people even though it's not out that's how good it is all right so like i was saying this game is the best one piece game on roblox at the moment whether you like it or not i personally don't like it at the moment i played it to the point where i just hate it you know but when i liked it i used to play this game od when i played it with my friends i personally didn't like playing it alone when i played it alone i usually played it for like 20 30 minutes pretty rare to catch me on the game for over an hour alone with that being said this game is a great game to play with friends some of you guys might like it you know might like playing it alone who knows if you do good for you but honestly in my opinion i think it's a great game to play with friends it'll be really fun to play with friends let's move on number four we have a bizarre day at number four a bizarre day is a great jojo game to play on roblox in my opinion there's plenty of jojo games on roblox and hey don't get me wrong those games are great as well but in my opinion i personally love playing this jojo game a bizarre day so what you basically do in this game is you bro, you can start off by playing this game today and end up be having a really really strong stand probably a stronger stand than someone who's been playing this game for a minute so this game it's not really a game you have to grind on you just basically hop on the game and look for arrows and once you find an arrow you use the arrow to give you a stand and if you don't like that stand you go around the map looking for this red thing i, I I don't know what that red thing is i forgot what you call it i think it's a fruit something fruit but it's some sort of fruit i think so you go around looking for this red fruit once you find that red fruit you basically take it eat it and once you eat that red fruit it resets your stand and then once it resets your stand then you could go around the map and look for an arrow if you have an arrow you could use the arrow right away and you could get another stand so yeah that's how the game pretty much works you get an arrow get a stand if you don't like that stand you'll need to look for that red fruit in order to reset your stand without that red fruit you'll be stuck with that certain stand that you have until you get a red fruit and yeah so let's say you have an arrow and you have a stand that you don't like and you try using the arrow to get another stand it won't work it won't work unless you reset your stand by looking for fruit um but yeah with that being said that's pretty much how the game works <laughs> Yeah, not that complicated, and it's a great JoJo game. If you guys like the JoJo anime, I would highly suggest you guys give this JoJo game a try. A bizarre day. Really great game to play. Let's move on. Number three. Number three is going to be Beyond. Beyond is a great game in my opinion. I really loved and enjoyed playing this game the past almost two years playing this game. I think two years. Was it two years or one year and something? Bruh but you get it guys i played this game for a really long time and i really enjoyed playing this game the only reason why i stopped playing this game was because the creators stopped updating it if the creators continued updating it till this day i would have still probably been playing it that's how good of a game it is uh you guys should definitely give it a try it's basically a game based off naruto anime naruto so if you guys watched naruto and you like the anime naruto give this game a try if you didn't watch naruto and you guys like naruto games or ninja type games give this game a try this game is a really really great game to play 
Uh, I still play it to this day at times. It's not really as fun as before. I play it for like 20 minutes, 30 minutes, and I still enjoy playing it. It's a great game. And till this day, mad people play it. It gets about 1,600 players a day, probably sometimes more. It's, so with that being said, this game is still alive, still fun. And if you guys are into Naruto, and into ninja games give this game a try i'm sure you're gonna like this game it has game modes it has a ranked match feature where you could go and fight online players in ranked matches uh, bro this game has so many game modes you could do so much stuff in this game and the moves are clean and it almost has every kg in the anime give this game a try if you guys like naruto i promise you won't regret it it's a great game to play and i've made a lot of videos on it in the past so if you guys do decide to get into this game and do enjoy this game Watch my videos to guide you through the game. I have a lot of videos on this game that could really help you out. With that being said, hope you guys get into this game and I hope you guys enjoy this game. It's a great game. And yeah, let's move on. Number two. Number two is going to be ABA. ABA is a great game. Most of you guys already know this game because it's a pretty popular game. It started blowing up this year. It's been out for a minute, but it started getting really, really popular this year. A lot of people played out of nowhere. I don't know why. Oh yeah, this game is a really great game. It's really, really fun. Warning though, this game has a lot of, lot of toxic players. But <laughs> that doesn't ruin it though. Even though it has a lot of toxic players and could be toxic at times, it's still a great game. You can't ruin it for you. Like, bro, I at first, I hated this game. I don't know why I did not enjoy playing it. But then I started getting into it and ranked matches, to be honest, was, was one of the main reasons why I started playing this game for a long time and start to get into this game and yeah i just loved playing ranked matches but overall this game is great the combat system and everything just everything about this game is perfect this game is a really 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 Bruh. really 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 Bruh. fun game to play i'm like bro if you didn't play the game give it a shot if you like watching anime give this game a shot it's basically a game with, with all the enemies combined, you could pick a character from a specific anime that you probably like. And you could go ahead and go into the game with that character and start using it to fight all the online players. And you could do 2v2s, 4v4s, uh, all that good stuff. It's a really nice game. And if you find that one character that you're good with and you really enjoy playing with, then you could really, you know, end up enjoying this game even more. So yeah, go into this game if you haven't played it yet, give it a shot and find that character that fits you and then from there, use that character to demolish online players in your way. And if you feel like you're skilled enough and good enough, go in ranked and put your skills into use. And with that being said, let's move on. Number one, final stand is going to be standing at number one. There's a good reason why this game is going to be number one, because this game is the best. When I mean the best, I mean it, the best Dragon Ball Z game on roblox and also the best anime game on roblox in my opinion fun fact if it wasn't for this game your boy wouldn't have never came back to roblox and your boy would have never became a youtuber this game got me back to roblox and also inspired me to become a youtuber i started streaming every single day playing this game because i enjoyed streaming and playing this game i played this game every single day for a really long time. I met great friends on this game that I still know till this day. This game is a really, really good game that you should give a try. If you didn't give this game a try, you have to give it a try. If you don't, tell me you're missing out big time. It's a game that you don't want to miss out on. Everybody deserves to give this game a try. It's a really fun game. I remember playing this game every single day and there's a lot of features. <laughs> that you could take advantage of in this game. Like there's something called top where you go with friends to defeat Jiren. It's basically, it's this game is 100% based off the Dragon Ball game. Everything in this game, not game, I mean show. Everything in this game was inspired and made from, not made from, but was inspired from the original Dragon Ball Z show, anime show. Yeah, so. If you watch the Dragon Ball Z show, then everything in this game is going to be very, very, very familiar for you guys. But if you didn't watch Dragon Ball Z anime show, then this game is going to be, everything's going to be basically new to you. Everything. So you'll have to learn everything from scratch. But if you did watch the show, this game won't be that hard to get into. But either way, if you're new to this game, I highly suggest you watch YouTube videos to get, to get you into this game. 
But other than that, you, you don't, you don't, you honestly don't need YouTube videos. Bruh. It's easy to get into this game alone, and you'll be enjoying it. Trust me, it's a great game to get into. There's this feature that I love, love taking advantage of. It's called instant transmission, and what it basically is is basically a feature that allows you to teleport to random players as long as you have their username and as long as they're in game. It doesn't matter where they are in game; they could be in a different server, different planet. As long as you have their username, you could easily teleport to them. And I used to teleport to random online players and, and tell them to come to my stream and watch me when I started YouTube. I used to be a super small YouTuber back then. Man, memories. But honestly, that feature was one of the features that I really enjoyed taking advantage of. That feature it just made the game a lot more fun for me. Click the first link in the description if you haven't joined my Discord and join up. If you haven't gotten my Fire merch, click the merch link in the description and cop up. I'm hosting a giveaway. The prize is going to be a surprise. In order to enter the giveaway, you'll have to smash the like button on the video, subscribe, and turn on notifications, and leave a comment in the comment section below. Make sure your comment has this hashtag. I'm going to be announcing the winners in my Discord server in the giveaway channel. So if you haven't yet, join my Discord. <laughs>